guys, welcome back to another video. So today I'm going to show you how I will prepare a fettuccine with chicken and broccoli recipe. Um, I'm just going to do it really simple and easy for you guys. Um, so here I have three chicken breasts and I am going to add some salt, black pepper, and some lemon and pepper seasonings. So I am using the fettuccine which is this one right here. I'm not using the whole pack. I'm just gonna grab a few out and boil this in water. So I do have my pot uh, with water boiling for the fettuccine. And my chicken, I am going to cut them up in pieces and put them on a separate um, pan. So, and I will be adding some broccoli. These are frozen broccoli. So I'm just gonna rinse them off and you could add them as small pieces like these or chop them up a little less, however you wanna do it. I'm not doing my own um, sauce, so I am using the ragu sauce, which has the roasted garlic parmesan flavor. And to um, cook my chicken, I will be adding some butter to it as well. So with that being said, please make sure to watch the full recipe, I mean the full video, so you won't miss a step. So let's get started with that. Boiling, I'm going to grab a few out of this box. Uh, depends how much you're gonna make. Um, so I'm just gonna grab a few and put them in there so they can start cooking. Eventually, once they start cooking, they will shrink and go down. So just keep an eye on it and let it just simmer in. So I'm just gonna give it a few minutes, maybe a minute. Simmered in there, I'm going to add two teaspoons of salt into my water. And just stir it in there. Now we're gonna put this on a low heat until it gets softened. And we'll be back to check up on that. And while this is cooking, I'm gonna start to um, cut my chicken and season it. So let's get to that. Chicken up. Now I'm just gonna, oh, and I rinsed my broccoli. So now I'm just gonna drizzle some salt to get all those flavors. You could add your um, seasonings when you are cooking your chicken either way, but I'm doing it here. and my black, I mean, lemon pepper. So now I'm gonna um, get my pan going and add some butter. So let's get to that process. Pan here and I'm gonna have it on a low heat and I'm adding one full tablespoon of butter I'm using butter. Um, you can use oil if you want. So I'm just gonna melt the butter all the way to add our chicken and broccoli. So now I'm gonna add my chicken in there. Now I can put my heat into a medium high heat so you can cook your chicken. 
So we're gonna cook this up. I will check on, on it in about five to eight minutes or so until it's fully cooked and tender, softened. Okay. And we'll be back on that. Okay guys, so my fettuccine is still cooking and I have it on a medium low heat so it could cook well and my chicken is still going. I covered it up so cooking faster. I'm going to give it about 5 more minutes and then I will add my broccoli. broccoli to my chicken now so I'm just gonna let that cook in and we will add of our ragu sauce I'm not adding the whole thing in there I'm just gonna give it enough to give it a very good flavor Now I'm gonna mix it around. And then once it starts to simmer, cook, since the broccoli is already pre-cooked, I'm just gonna um, cover it up for about three minutes. So I'm going to cover it up on a low heat for three minutes. So since I gave it about three minutes to simmer in, now I'm going to add my fettuccine in here. So I'm going to put this on a low, on a very low heat. And we are going to drain out our fettuccine and then add it to this pot right here. Okay, so I drained it. Now I'm going to add it on here. Mix it all together. Since I didn't add the whole sauce in here, I'm going to add it in a few seconds. I just want to get everything in here. And I'm going to add a, one teaspoon of basil to give it a kick of that flavor. Okay. So just one teaspoon, okay here it goes, one teaspoon, drizzle it, and now I'm going to add the rest of my sauce into my pan here. And now we're going to mix. Remember, I do have this on a low heat. If you want it creamy, you can add the whole sauce jar in there. If you don't like it too creamy, you could just add half of it. However you like. Smells good. Looks good. And that's about it, guys. Very simple, easy recipe. And you can also um, do it as a shrimp or chicken. So it's up to you guys. Today I wanted to do a chicken fettuccine with broccoli. So now I'm just gonna turn the heat off and serve. Look how good this looks guys. Now I'm just gonna serve it in this plate. Get a little bit of your chicken, broccoli. Delicious. So, hope you guys enjoyed this recipe, quick and easy. Uh, don't forget to give this video a like and share. Comment down below. 
and like always subscribe to my channel for more easy recipes so see you guys on the next one